What if I'm going to tell you that you can create your website for free with a free domain name in hosting? Yes, it can be done. But before that, just hit the subscribe button below and let's get started right now. What's up guys? Welcome to this video. Now the first thing we are going to do is to have your free domain name. Now we are going to get that one on freenom.com. So you need to go to freenom.com and create your account. All of the links that I'm going to use here in this tutorial would be on the description below. So you can scroll down there and click on the links right away. So once you've already created your account on Phenom, you can go and log in right away or you can also use social sign in. I'm going to use my uh, Google Gmail here. Okay, once you have already logged in, you can see here it says hello, Jinar, and let's go to services to register a new domain. Okay, and we can check for availability of our desired domain name. I'm going to type here like that and check for availability. So you can see here these are free, zero cost, zero, zero, zero. So I'll just go for the first one here, click this one, get it now. And you can choose all of these ones also if you want to. Now you go there, check out. Once you're on checkout page, you can see here how long you're going to use this one you can use it for up to 12 months but more than that you need to pay so you can use this one for 12 months now if 12 months of, is already done you can actually renew that one okay so after clicking on the 12 months free all right just click continue and there you go it's done that's our uh, details it will get all the details we have there and then i have read complete order and then we're done all right there you go so uh, order confirmation it's already done we can go back to our client area and check that one if it's there my domains go to my domains now that we're done with our free domain we'll be back later to configure the dns settings now it's time for us to get a hosting now let's go to zero zero web host i have the link on the description below so just go there and sign up okay once you sign up you complete the registration if you are already done creating your account and make sure that you have uh, really uh, verified that one on your email you can see it here I've already verified that one the next thing we're going to do is going to manage website okay so we're going to manage our website and then you can see it here we have a one-click install of WordPress so we can go and install this one just click this one so we are going to create our username and password there And then this would be the website, the link that we are going to use, but we can change this one later and then install. Now you can see the, you scroll down here and you can see the progress below. So it says here, it would take up to 60 seconds to set up. Okay, when it's already done, you can go to configuration page. See it here, click that one, and it will take us there. This is actually our login already on our uh, WordPress now we're going to set up so that this one will not show up you can see guaki jinard 0 web host app.com so we don't if we try to visit actually this one the website is already there however we don't want people seeing 0 web host app on our name so that is your website already this is the default website of WordPress that we can edit later on so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to configure our domain name our free domain name from freenome.com we're going to use this one guaki.ginard.tk and then if you're going to try to see our website right now it says 00 web host app and we don't want this one okay so let's go back to our 00 web host dashboard and we're going to click on set web address okay it says buy a domain from hostinger or no we don't mind so it's okay and then after that we go we have an our own domain we're going to use it click this one and what's the domain name so guaki ginard.tk once we put that one already uh make sure to copy and paste this one okay so we're going to copy this one and go to freenom freenom and then we're going to manage our domain click manage and then we're going to name servers tools use custom name servers so we're going to paste and then go back to web host and then we're going to copy the other one actually the number is only changed there and then paste it to the second name server now we are going to change name servers once done we can go back to our 
zero uh, zero web host and then let's say part okay once it's already part so it says here waiting for name servers so let's go back and check on our phenome uh, if we actually pasted the right name servers so phenome yeah there you go that's the name servers and take note that uh, you can see this one you can change where your domain points to here please be aware changes can take up to 24 hours but for me my experience here was actually like 30 minutes is it's already there our uh, website is already synced together the domain name from freenome is already working you can see it here it just took me about let's say 10 minutes to wait for this one so you can click on this one open new tab and then we can open this one a new tab so we can check it yeah that's my website and at the same time this is my website so if you want to edit your website you go here okay or the same with this one so you can click this one and then just type on WP dash admin and you're going to go to the login page on the dashboard on where you're going to edit your page if you want to show your website to the other uh, to the public just let them know that this is your domain name and it's going to work okay just click that one it's the same guaki.tk okay see you next time i'm going to have more videos and don't forget to subscribe down below and if you want me to make more videos just hit the like button down there and comment down below